Hey, I'm Joe Lowry. I use Katsu um, every morning while I walk, and my walking is still very um, challenging for me. It requires uh, assistance from somebody there as what they call in therapy, contact guard precautions, and I'll strap the bands on my legs and walk around with it, run a cycle, and then I use it again in the evenings for a cool down just passively as I'm reading and going through my um, my evening cool down routines mm -hmm. to prepare for sleep. And I've noticed specifically the nights when I don't have time to put it on, I don't sleep as well. So right. I'm like, that's a huge deal. Right. Uh, but I mean, that's how I, and then, oh, and then in the morning, I also use it on my arms after I'm done training the legs, doing walking with it all, because my left arm is what they call involved or affected. So I have flexor tone in it, meaning my hand clenches down like that, and I'll have it on my left arm and right arm, and I'll just do, I have this unit called a uh, Sabo flex, which opens my hand up mechanically, and then I'll grasp and release, exercise it on, in front of my bed with the Katsu cycle on, I'll run a cycle, and then, and my caregivers have specifically told me, and I've noticed this too, like with the legs, I have a tone, a non-volitional tone because of the injury to my brain. And I'm like, I notice that it decreases it quite a bit or it's more functional because my caregiver's like, oh, your hand is a lot less tight tonight. Mm. Did you train this morning? I was like, no, actually I didn't. That's interesting. Uh, uh.